Hello everyone, and welcome back to a new episode of a Unicorn Overlord. I, I said that a little bit weird. The last time we left off, we have a side quest to do. And uh, I don't believe I have everything I needed for this. Yeah, needed more lumber. So, uh, yeah. I don't think I'm really gonna take much time running around doing stuff on the map. I did most of that last time, so... I am still getting over my cold a little bit, so if I sound a little weird, that would be why. But, uh, yeah. Let's go over here and do this. This is dealing with, uh, the, um, the general that, that took out the, uh, the Rose, yeah, Knights of the Rose, there it is. I was like, I should probably look at the screen, it probably has it there. Yeah. Dealt a near fatal blow to the Knights of the Rose ten years past. Now the Liberation marches for vengeance. There are going to be Legionnaires to take out, which is just the upgraded, uh, Hoplite class. I've heard the plan, Joseph. If you can even call it that. You intend to do nothing and bide our time until the general is shipped off. Just so, my lady. We strike after he's departed the fortress, before his successor has time to arrive. Absent a leader to marshal its defenses, even the most ironclad of strongholds will fall to the chaos of war. Spineless old man. What will any of this accomplish if we let that monster slip through our fingers? Tell me, Joseph! Princess, please. I understand your anger towards Zenoira, but this seems to be far beyond that. What is your history with Geeth? I guess you wouldn't know. Ten years ago, he sought to prove his allegiance to Galerius through a sacrifice of royal blood. My blood. The Barbarian? Then the reason you fled to Drakenhold was to break free of his reach. Yes. I was meant to cross the border with my retinue, the Knights of the Rose. But it wasn't to be. I fear I can imagine how this story ends. Yeah, I mean, we already pretty much saw the event last time, so... They surrendered their lives so that mine could endure. Barred his path with their fallen corpses. It is nice to get another perspective on it, specifically from the person that was saved, thanks to their sacrifice. I lost every last one of them. And now, as the only survivor of that slaughter, it falls on me to avenge their deaths. Geese's head will roll by my blade. Tis a painful memory indeed, my princess. Yet, in this harsh world, every skirmish could be our last. And any false move might risk the safety of our men. I assure you, should the opportunity arise, we shall see the general slain. I don't want your empty promises. I've waited an entire decade for this chance, and I'm not about to let it escape me. Your ladyship. Leia. I take it you heard all that. I did. I wasn't intending to pry, ma'am. I've lost my appetite for conversation. We can speak more on this tomorrow. <sighs> I hope you can forgive my ignorance, Princess. That was the first I'd heard of such tragedy. That'll be the last you hear of it, too. It's an old story, and one that bears no meaning to Drakenhold. Even so, I must say, Sir Joseph's strategy is sound. We would be wise to accept it without dispute. <laughs> I've always admired your boldness, Leia. But this burden is mine to bear, and mine alone. Save your opinions for someone who will hear them. Now go get some rest. Battle will be upon us before long. Yeah, I mean, it definitely makes sense as a strategy. But we do have to take into account how other people feel about letting uh, this person get away. Making a martyr of yourself won't bring them back. <sighs> You're here to stop me too, then. Yay, we got all of them. Keytro, Fran, and Miriam. Are you kidding? We just don't want to miss out on the action. We may not match your years in the Order, but we embody the Rose. Same as you. From the moment I joined as a fledgling squire, I vowed to be your shield in times of strife. That vow... That spirit stands unchanged even now. 
Please, my princess. You're not alone in hungering for vengeance. Let us join you. Together, we claim Geeth's head, and the honor of our order with it. You're right. I should never have considered doing this without you. We stand at the ready, my lady. Knights of the Rose. We march at once to avenge the atrocities inflicted on our fallen sisters. Yes, ma'am. Right. Gotcha. All right. There we go. Are they going to be like a required squad that's sitting out there in this battle? Because that will mess up with some of my formations. Yes, they are. That's a neat idea. Fulfilled. We must be after her, Your Highness. Please be safe. Okay. Uh, this is getting pretty serious. We're even getting some flashbacks with uh, how Joseph factors into all this. Our aim in this battle, as you would expect, is the capture of Fort Prince Lasse. However, we cannot sit idly by while Princess Virginia advances alone. Solitary units such as hers will struggle to retreat should they find themselves under attack. Virginia shall be our first priority. We can turn our attention to Prince Lassa once that we've made her see reason. One more thing, Your Highness. The path forward is littered with enemy garrisons and fortresses. God, there is a lot. Sturdy defenses behind which Fort Pritzla said lies. Hence, I believe it vital that we seize them as our own amidst our approach. Yeah, probably a good call. The operation demands two opposing goals. A swift rescue and a cautious march. As such, I propose, propose we divide our army into two squadrons capable of succeeding in both simultaneously. That's in. I humbly request that you allow me to recover the princess myself. I'll not rest until I've delivered her to safety. I swear it upon my very life. I was actually going to say, even before this happened, that this is a fight I think I would want to put Joseph in, just because it makes plot sense. The rebels here, as if they didn't have as if I didn't have enough to worry about already. Though if I could deliver their leader's head to Emperor Galerius, yes, that would make a great gift indeed. Perhaps even great enough to spare me his ire. Ha! <laughs> what a timely turn of events. Monster's still here, is he? Come, we strike for vengeance. Fool. Corpse will make for a uh, welcome meal for the dogs. Okay. And yeah, we are starting to run into upgraded units now, so that is something that I definitely need to watch out for. Okay. So I need to have Joseph speak to you. It seems. Yeah. Okay, so that's something. Once we get control of this catapult, that's going to make things a lot easier. We also have this side that we need to go down. I'm going to need a flyer to collect that item. There's another catapult right there. Having access to that one would really help with this. Okay, and then as far as units go, I'm obviously going to want some mages in since we do have... Uh, Legionnaires. Okay. And then we have, like, some archers and a few other things. Um, something I should mention. A, uh, comment on the previous video mentioned that, uh, the expert difficulty actually makes it so you get less valor points, and it's what introduces that limit to items. That actually wasn't there before. So now that we're playing on expert, I have to be a little bit more careful about how I spend my valor and I, you know, use my items, so... Alrighty, I don't have all of my squads prepped yet, but uh, these are the three that I'm going to use right now. I kind of want to have one Valor in the pocket. But, uh, so just what we've got going right now, I haven't edited anybody else. We have Elaine in this group. I didn't really change too much about you. I did move Guarding Impetus down here, just so you don't use that when I don't want you to. Basically, but uh, you didn't change too much. I have Rolfin. Because we are moving against a bunch of thieves, basically. Uh, I have you on the Desert Bow, Carnelian Pendant, Lucky Coin. 
didn't really change too much here. Everything's pretty much the same. I have Selfie, or Selfie, and, uh, in. And, uh, I gave her the detoxifying amulet because, uh, we are actually running into a bunch of thieves, or, or scouts, so they have, uh, they have the, the toxic throw or whatever. So I did that. I also just really wanted to use you. Um, I do think I can give you a better bangle. There you go. And then, uh, I have Dorothea, which is the, uh, rando arbalist that I got. I'm probably gonna try to use you, but I wanted to put Liza on a different team once it came up. So, for now... You are on Rapid Shot, which, uh, attack a single enemy with a first strike inflicts stun. Uh, I got you that because it was honestly just a better bow. And it's a pretty cool effect. So, I have that active, and I gave you the Lapis Pendant so that you could also use Medical Aid when we needed. Didn't really mess with the, uh, you know, priority of these things. We march. But, uh, I, I did waste, like, a second, because, uh, I put out Joseph's unit, and I had the wrong leader. I'll explain that in just a moment. The path is set. Hmm. The time is at hand. Let's actually not, let's actually let them come to us. Where is that shooting? Oh, they just got in it. Okay. So, Joseph's squad. Uh, I put Joseph in front. I gave Joseph the Azure Crest Shield that I pick up. I also gave Joseph the Liberator's Bracelet, which is just basically a better version of the skill he already has. This one gets rid of, uh, you know, an enemy's debuffs. Could I, like, prioritize? Prioritize buff. Yeah, or gets rid of the uh, enemy's buffs, rather. So we have that going. You have Holy Barrier, Holy Guard. I said Holy Barrier to only activate if they have less than 75% HP. And otherwise, we're pretty good there. So, that's that. Didn't really change much here. I did give Clive the Dove Plume, just so he can act a little bit faster. Everything else is absolutely the same there. And then on Lex's squad, Lex has the three... Or the two Griffin Knights and the one Wyvern Knight that's left. Uh, didn't really change too much about Lex. I did give him the Knight's Medallion. He also has the Cavalry Hunter's Buckler, because this is going to be my Cavalry Hunting squad. We have the Carnet Axe on Emilie, along with the Vitality Talisman. Uh, I did give Hilda. Hilda didn't really have any accessories. So I gave her the Heaven Wyvern Reigns, because it makes sense. Which gives us Aerial Wing. Makes the user's next attack a true strike, and the user gets 20% attack if the user is at 100% HP. Which I think is pretty fun. Um, I also have ground counter set up so that it checks for cavalry enemies. If there aren't any, then you prioritize deflecting. If you still have passive points, then you use ground counter on not cavalry targets. And then, yeah, you're pretty much the same as you were before. So, those are the three squads that I am currently using. Command. So, let's get in there and see what we can do. So, hit you and hit you. So, I'm going to let this uh, scout run into me because then I can just kill this uh, watchtower for free, basically. Proceed with caution. So, if I let them come to me. You face me. Yeah. That's pretty free. I want to see the fight. I want to look at our cool characters do cool things. There's the evade. There's another evade. But... Yeah. There's the quick curse. You poisoned me, but we're going to poison cure. That is the reason I put that on you. And there's another curse. We do still get poisoned, though. Which does suck. I mean, I mean, there's three of them, you know. What realistically could I do against that? So, I was a little bit low, or slow on that, but at least I got rid of the passive points. Totally dumpstering these, uh, thieves. So... There we are. Go ahead and get some nice healing. And, as you can see, we are quite good. Beautiful. Pretty healthy. And I'm even gonna heal up a ton... ...with you. And we're going to get healed one more time. And then, yeah, we are also going to get the medicinal aid, so we're totally fine. That is one healthy squad. Alright, and now you go in 
and take this enemy out. To me. All right, so now we just let things unfold. Uh, could you please get out of that zone faster, Virginia? I can't control you, so you really need to hightail it and not get murdered by falling rocks, please. Thank you. Their eyes are on me. Yeah, I can I tell. Nothing back. All right. We really, really need to get to Virginia. What would you ask? Uh, talk, please. By your word. Uh, uh oh, that's gonna hit us if we're not careful. Oh my God, Virginia, why are you being such a stubborn and idiot? Uh, can't do a wild rush. Obviously, I don't want to move into that. So we're gonna go this way and continue. As you wish. And then yeah, you're working your way what over there. Do? I have you taking a bit of a weird path, so just go for a straight shot. I'm going. Okay. And things are happening over there now. Your villainy ends here. We are also about to be hit by a catapult. Not fun. I won't hold you back. Alright, thank you, Selvi. Okay, so... If we get into the watchtower, it looks like we're fine. Uh, I'll have to let somebody else cap this watchtower, because I'm currently just trying to catch up to you. I could... Hasten call you, so you can just catch up faster. This is using a passive point, but I think it's worthwhile. Just so you can a catch faster. Wind, it seems. All right, so Tis ours. good. Uh, so Time you. Mm. They are kind of annihilating us. It's those mages, yeah. I thought Selvi would hurt or would help a little bit more in that regard. First things first, though, we're gonna go take that other catapult out, because that thing is being very, very annoying right now. Okay, so talk, now that we're out of the... out of the danger zone here. Hello. Yeah, things are going great. I'm relieved to find you unharmed, my princess. Now, come. Flee this danger and return to our side. Joseph. I know the truth hidden behind those words. This selfish display of mine has thrown others squarely in harm's path. I admit, the battle has been more of a struggle than I anticipated. But no struggle is too great when compared to your safety. I was wrong, Joseph. In a fit of rage, I stood my most loyal subjects before the might of an entire army. And in so doing, almost repeated the very tragedy I seek to avenge. Hey, it's not your fault. We are ever ready to lay our lives down for you should the need arise. Yeah, but you shouldn't have to if we can avoid it. The captain surely felt the same all those years ago. Forgive me, friends. This is as far as we go on our own. Prepare to rally with Elaine and the others at once. Well, that was very easy. All it took was a few rocks falling on your head for you to realize, hey, you know what? Maybe uh, us charging an entire fortress by ourselves against an entire enemy army isn't the best call. <clears throat> Thank you. All right, so I basically have another free squad out here. Wow, really rude that it didn't pause there. Uh, so... Woof. We get destroyed fighting most of the enemies over here. I mean, this isn't like the most ideal squad. Wait, why is Virginia in the back? No. No, Fran, you get in the back. Virginia, you move in the front. Oh, wow, their, their party makeup was quite garbage too. Okay, that would be part of it. Uh, I can give you a warrior's medallion. It is your job class, after all. 
And you're already pretty much set up how I would want you to be. Uh, Miriam. Mm. Gravekeeper boots. Hmm. Eh. Just take this. The leaf brooch. Okay. So... Should mostly be fine there. That looks good to me, and I think that's definitely a better party makeup. Makes things a little bit better. Yeah. Obviously still not ideal. Okay, we can take out these squads. Okay, so that's where you're heading. You're going up there. We can get rid of one of the catapults and get rid of some of these enemies. That, that looks all? good to me. Awaiting your command. Joseph. Uh... Oh, yeah, we get annihilated by them. Don't want to do that. Probably we'll just let this squad handle that. So we will take out this one, though, at Clayter Town. As you wish. And then, Elaine, you're still doing your thing. So, I can work on deploying another unit now. Question is, do I want to? I think at the moment I'm kind of fine and I don't have a lot of valor anyway. So I want to kind of save it to use some abilities should it become a problem. I should have shown that fight. That was probably a cool one. I love this squad so much. I'm even better than Clive now. My beautiful, beautiful cavalry charge. I'll not let this go to waste. Everything in service of my people. Oh my god, Renault, that's a disgusting level up. I've not chosen my grave yet. I'll oh my god. Okay. So that's all well and good. I would love a squad that could efficiently take them out. So that might be what we work on, because even Elaine is going to have a hard time defeating them. Alright, everybody's got their jobs. Should have known it was catapults making all that horrible noise. Here, yeah, this will help you show them who's boss. Ooh. Well, those boulders hit you no problem uh, if you end up stuck somewhere. If you use an hourglass, then it'll be like nothing ever happened. I get out there and give them hell. Okay, uh... Negate stage damage suffered by an ally unit. Interesting. Okay. I don't know why, but, uh... Cool. Probably gonna have to have a, uh, that squad, like I said, take them out. But this squad can go down here and take care of these dorks. As yeah. you wish. So go ahead and ride. We do have four squads on the field now. I do have a little bit more valor. So we could work on that hit squad I was talking about that could uh, take out that team of mages. Uh, the question is, who would be the best at doing it? I don't know, honestly. Maybe... Let's see, Miriam's in the other squad. And I don't think I have another person, like another tank that's good at dealing with magic. Hmm. Because, yeah, you're currently deployed. Yeah, I mean... I might just send in Bruno. Maybe give him, like, ridiculous magic defense. I do need to use Ocleese at some point. I was considering putting you into a party. So we might do that soon. <sighs> Let's stick with Bruno. And... Currently have a Leaf Brooch. Gauntlets. Blue Spectacles. Let's take the gauntlets off. Is there something I can give you? Burn immunity would be good. Salamander ring would be even better. Let's give you the salamander ring. And... Is there someone better I can put in here for dealing with the mages is the next question. Aubin will be good at taking out the character. Does that. I think the squad will do well enough. Oh... God... Maybe not. Yeah, that hurts. 
That hurts. But obviously I don't want to use... Hmm. I do not want to use... Uh, what's it called? I think I let them go fight you though. They're gonna get absolutely destroyed. But Elaine doesn't fare much better. I, I guess... Elaine does fare okay against them. Then we could stop and heal. Whereas this squad, yeah. It's gonna take them ages to get over there as well. Yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm canceling that whole line of thought. And let's just withdraw you. And we'll take them out with Elaine's group and then rest, I think. Okay. Joseph, everybody else is doing their thing. God, Joseph's so fast with you that group. Me. Okay, let's see how this shakes out. That source, uh, that, or source, not a sorcerer, but that stronger unit is the scary one. See, I knew that attack was going to be useful. You're still alive, unfortunately. And that's with the magic weaken. There we go, good shit. Good shit, Rolf. Yeah, this is a good team. No crits. That is fine. We are burning. Yeah, that's where most of our damage is being taken. There we go. Good defense. Take all the hits, Elaine. I need to buff, uh, that's probably the next class I'm gonna try to promote. Some of my archers, they definitely, definitely need it. Your strength failed. Uh, alrighty. Here we go. They're, they're getting a lot of attacks off because they have a ton. And so many magic pursuits. Oh, god. Lethargy takes you! All of that, uh, <laughs> all of that burn really adding up. Yeah, I mean, having that burn resistant thing that I had on, uh, Bruno was a good call. We'll still be able to win, though, so it's fine. I just throw them in again, we win, and heal. That'll be fine. But yeah, the burn immunity, definitely what you want to run against that. I should have just put it on a lane before I threw a lane in, because we can swap equipment like that. The only problem is a lane doesn't have a lot of things to swap off, but I could have taken off the sabatons and put them on him. But that would have been an optimization there, that would have made that fight a lot easier. I even had the right idea with you, I just decided it was going to take too long for you to walk over there. Do need to make sure I grab that item. Okay. Come then. Die. Yeah, god, that upgraded mage was scary. There's always more to learn. We did have a lower level unit in the squad, too. Alright. Get in there, Elaine. The path is set. Get your stamina back. And heal up and all that. We're saved. Oh, how can I ever repay you? Actually, I think I have just a thing. Here. Thank you. You ever find yourself struggling to move? This will get back to normal again in no time. Just be sure to use it before the enemy hurts you too bad. Okay. No holding back. Now this is finally done. So I can start catapulting myself. So... Ah, <sighs> that ranged assist is annoying. I don't have a Wind Fairy charm, do I? No. I need to find out where I can get those. What does the Gold Hourglass do? Instantly ends the wait time of the user's unit. That's quite nice. Yeah, alright. Knock them back. We're all going to take a pretty significant portion of damage. But we live. And now I can just Very run well. through this archer. What are we doing? You get into the catapults. See you later. Alright. Come. Boom. That is good. For the liberation. 
awaiting your and ooh. I mean they're free basically so I'll kill them first then we can kill the other squad but we're gonna have to try and focus on healing here what would you ask let's actually use one of these on Joseph now we're in a little bit better fighting condition and I can kill this Very squad well. gaze upon the face of okay your demise. yeah we we rolled right through them they did kill Joseph For but that's fine is it my finest hour Ooh, we can almost kill this group. And if I kill them, I can get in here. Ooh, this is good. Ah, uh, they are about to have someone come in, though. And we're almost out of stamina. <clears throat> this may prove perilous. Restore 50% HP to an allied unit. You're dead, though, so that doesn't count. Get into the catapult. And we're almost in the catapult right there. Okay, and here's something I can do. Uh, how many more mages do we have down this way? We have different types of mages. Yeah, so... We're probably going to be swapping the salamander ring off of you now. Do I have like a freeze immunity thing? I don't. I need that. I should get some of those. Cause yeah, there's not really much here that's gonna help you otherwise. I can give you a bronze circlet, but at that point it would be better just to leave that on. Yeah. All right, get out there though. Let's get going already. What do you need? And take that squad yep. out. All right, sorry, had to step away really quickly, but we are back, and you know, Elaine, you can just rest. You'll heal up and get your rest in. I'm realizing that's probably a good call. Command, your okay, so who would I want to hit with some of these things? There's an enemy squad right there I could hit. I was actually getting in here so that we could kind of stop these enemies, but that's not really going to work out at this particular point, huh? So maybe I just take the free hit on, like, one of those. Probably going to have to have them eat some smoke nuts. Made it. Okay. As for you... They're coming at me, so that's not really going to help too much. I can hit them. They take 50% less damage, but... I mean, it's still something. These rebel worms have come far enough. Send out the reinforcements now. We'll deploy as many as it takes. Okay. Annoying, but I can deal with that. Good. Proceed with caution. Kneel before me. And yeah, you're pretty much dead. Bye bye. There's so many catapults on this map that once we kind of get this under control, oh my god, our life's gonna be way easier. I do have to watch those rocks currently falling on my head though. That's a little bit of a problem. Good job, Alvin. Uh, because, yeah, where are those rocks at right now? Are those the ones coming at me? Maybe we move you out of the way. Just to be safe. Yeah, I mean, you're going to die, so that's fine. Is anyone surprised? Oh, it's the rocks coming from right here. Oh my god, get out of there. 
Okay, that's that unit dead. We do get out just in the nick of time. Is that all? Take you out. Aubin, you need to cap that. All right, we're we're doing work. We're doing work here. Uh, that worries me because they are technically resting right now. Perhaps a bit of caution. Hmm. Problem. Uh, let's see here. What could I do? If I'd caught this earlier, a silver hourglass probably would have worked. We're halfway done with our wait time. Hmm. Conveyance stone. Okay, how much does this do? There we go. Alright. Uh, move, kill the squad. There we go. You are going to have to rest or have some stuff after this. Uh, let's see. They're not sending any enemies over here at the moment, so I think that's fine. I think we're good with that. Okay, and then everything else is happening around the map here. Let's uh, see about hitting all three of these. They still need to get that item. All right, I think we're fine. That one was shooting at me, but we're still good. You dare challenge me? Hmm. That's a little annoying. We barely win, but we do win. That's a dead Miriam, though. I might teleport you back I'm off. once things cool off a little bit. Okay, big damage to those three. Oh, but now we... Oh. Oh, so they're not like... Okay, so the reason I prioritized getting Joseph out of the wait state there, I thought this was like considered the the squad resting but they're more so just reloading the catapult so they can still fight back it's not like when they're resting it has like the same sort of like little thing on their unit the little clock so i thought it was the same kind of deal but no we can still fight back like this okay that makes this even better getting stronger by the day good stuff all righty they're still recharging, so I can't really do much with them at the moment. You're still resting. You got orders Can for you me? do anything of note? Yeah, at this particular point, I think you're just moving to take this. I really thought they were going to do better than that. Hmm. Ah, uh, they do have an upgraded one. I mean, what I could do is fire on you. Just to soften you up a little bit and then send my units in. Because they get obliterated by it, so obviously I'm not going to be using them. Uh. Perhaps a bit of caution. Hmm. We are running out of item uses here. We are running out of item uses. Let's use this, though. And then, obviously, I want to revive you. Okay, so... How's the fight look like that? Pretty good. Um, let's go ahead and heal you, though. With our bit of valor there. Okay, so, yeah, pretty good. And we should be able to take them out from that. Okay, things are getting better. Gaze upon the face of your demise. Slowly but surely taking out all of these uh, little bases and things. Okay, you're still gonna go in. God, that hasten call is still going. It really shows you how few seconds actually pass in a battle if you're like 
really going crazy with your moves and optimizing them. What would you ask? Very well. Okay, so we'll be hitting them shortly. This squad might actually be pretty good against them. But this squad also has these dorks coming in to deal with. Uh alright. You don't stand a chance. There we go. Dead. A paltry effort. Watch and that, that makes my life a little bit easier here. Hoist Get into the, the catapult. Good stuff. What's next? So how much damage do they take? Ah, uh, they take They take full damage. Cool. Bye bye. I only hope they don't do the exact same thing to me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that might be a problem if they do. I'll have to use a conveyance stone if they shoot at me just like I'm shooting at them. Ideally, I would kill them before they got the opportunity to, but there's no guarantee that's going to happen. Alright, still want a lane to heal a little bit more. We will withdraw and redeploy in a moment, though, to get a lane just a little bit deeper into the battle. But things are going pretty swimmingly right now. I could send out, like, one more squad just to kind of clean some things up. But that's kind of what I'm planning to do with you. Let's just see how things pan out for a second here. No that's running. happening. Fine. Good level up. Alright. Now you. You could run in here and just defeat them. You'll get kind of obliterated by them. So yeah. Go battle them. Looks good to me. Bonk. Here we go. That's taken out. You're coming at me. We will live very easily. Gaze upon the face of your demise. Bye bye. Only one of you lives because you managed to dodge a bunch. All right. Well, this battle went pretty swimmingly. I would say. Uh, hello. Uh, sure. How many is that gonna hit? Two. I'll take two. A paltry effort. There you go. Okay, and we're at max. We are at max now. Okay. We Elaine's watch. pretty much recovered. Just a we, will with, we will withdraw you. Still there's this squad sitting here in the middle that's I'll being kind of annoying you. at this point. Uh... Oh, I did not mean to withdraw you. My bad, Joseph. Uh... Well, let's deploy a lanes unit. The day will be ours. You face we can me. kill them pretty easily, which does give Elaine the opportunity to heal. Well fought. Now we cannot defeat you. Let's uh, redeploy Joseph, In service of the royal family. just so you can heal up a little bit. I mean, I could go down here and shoot real quick. Alright, you're done. Just like Aubin said. Wasn't even Alright. So, how are you doing now against them? Still not great. Maybe one more of those? Ready to move. They fare a little bit better now, so... I think I will send you over there. And then as far as this particular enemy goes, I could take them out basically for free here. So... There we are, that should be good. Okay. Try and make this fun, yeah? Uh, almost kill them. They're, they, they're very dodge heavy against melee attacks, so... Uh, oops. Sorry. 
Use that, uh, use that Vatalize. I have the Valor for it. Ready to move. And get him. Uh, oh, they got the heal, like, right before. Is that gonna save them? Too much. Oh my god, it is. Annoying! They just barely got the heal in time. You got orders for me? Can I finish you with this? No. Okay, that will, though. You know and definitely hasten call yourself. Okay. Worked out. So they're pretty much done at this point. Been waiting for this. We will grab... The watchtower that I need to cap. I'll probably just let Albin grab that. I'm going. You... Can shoot this unit. Or just get out and fight this one. Get out and fight that, that one, all? actually. They're coming at you anyway. Kneel before me. Okay, that's all of them dead. Now we just need to finish off... What is one it? other one... We do have some smoked nuts to use, but... I might as well just rest and use the silver hourglasses. Or just let that enemy kill themselves on my unit. Which they're about to do. You dare challenge me! Yeah, that's fine. We can just do that. Okay. Uh, need to rest before I'd say on. this is nearly cleared. They defeated my men, huh? Seems these rebels have more guile than I gave them credit for. Send them the next wave and bring our spirit numbers to bear. Wow, you just really like... Sending your... Your soldiers to die, huh? You really, really have a fun time with that. Yeah, they shouldn't move that fast, so... There we go. Missed one of them, but we got most of them. Enjoy, Dorothea. Kneel before me. Uh... Yeah, I mean, one... One infantry lives. Okay, you cap. Uh, you... Go get this, please. What are we doing? And then I probably want somebody to go up there and grab that item as well. Probably uh -oh. withdraw and redeploy you, maybe. Ready to move. Cause uh, I could put you like up here, and then you could just kind of run along the road, and we could start making some progress. Hmm. What do you need? I mean, I guess you can kind of already just walk this way. Seems to think it's faster to go that way. Interestingly. Would not have expected. I mean, I know they're slower walking through that, but jeez. Okay. Yeah, things are looking sufficiently captured at this point. I'm just gonna shoot a catapult at you. Should they hit you? Maybe not, actually. It's difficult to judge the distance sometimes. Oh my god, are you serious? Annoying. 3 HP Wyvern Knight. <laughs> Being an absolute nuisance right now. Okay, we did manage to catch... Catch them. Okay, now that you're dead, Virginia's unit can just rest since I don't need them to actually counterattack. I'll need to rest before continuing on. That's, That's fine. Go ahead and rest. Okay, so we grab that item, we grab you, and we're pretty much done. Uh, Elaine's group can start making some progress over here. Onward. And then you can as well, Joseph, once your squad is healed. Bye-bye. You die that time. My lance grows ever sharper. Tis cool. my dying spirit which drives me forth. Alright. And we are pretty much maxed out on Valor points. Five thousand. Yeah. You can go grab that. 
Yeah, Elaine's pretty much got it. They defeated my men, hmm. Seems these rebels have more guile than I gave them credit for. Oh, oh my god. You're just gonna keep doing this, huh? What would you ask? That's your MO currently. Just just send in a buttload of uh units to try and stop me. I'll not fail you. Okay. You're very annoying, I'll give you that. You but wish. we've basically exhausted that ahead. catapult up there. So I guess I will have to send in most of my units. We do have a camp up there, so we can utilize that. Uh, Good, we march. Hmm. Arrow rain? I mean, I have the stuff. Boom. Okay. Well, that was easy. Never mind. We don't even need to use that heal. I mean, I might as well, because I am right here, but we really don't need to. Alright, get in there, squads. Let's take this dork out. And I will use your buff, Elaine. You have to admit, I'm impressed you've made it this far. That just proves what fine offerings your head will make to our Emperor. And it appears I'll have to cut them from your necks myself. Now's our chance. Loose the catapults. Another one behind us. In the path's too narrow to dodge their fire. On the lane, we have to do something before that catapult flattens us. Uh... Huh. Um... What would you ask? Hmm. Let's, uh... Move over here. Oh. You're not even shooting a lane. That's not even scary then. All right, let's fight. Your demise shall serve me well. A fine jest. Nice stun. They get the refresh though. You are guarding a lot. That is quite annoying. The squad's not really focused on damage. Oh, I attacked the the wrong the wrong lane there with that. For sure. Nice dodge. Okay, you have Venomax, but we do have the ability to cure poison, so. There we are. God, that healer needs to die like yesterday. Guard seal. There we go. Ah, uh, you need to die. God, you're annoyingly tanky. Can I at least kill one? No, can't quite do enough damage. Okay. I mean, that, pre that went pretty well, though. Uh, I do need to use this royal order. That was kind of the thing I was talking about using. Or not royal, Valorous. Stronger than ever. There we, we are. Uh, oof. We still get messed up. This is why I wanted Joseph to be the one running in here, not a lane, because they fare a little bit better. They don't have someone to take out the. Watch my column though. The time is at hand. Let's uh give you the Valorous order though. Oh, you know what? Okay, so here's what we should do then. You run in, attack. Oh, it looks like Elaine's gonna die though. Hmm. I was gonna say you run in, attack, and then we do another one to to rebuff what them. What would you ask? Damage all enemies within the range. Extra potency. Nah, you just go in first. Will soon be upon I shall hold yeah. Nothing back. Yeah, we're gonna get kind of messed up here. It's a very tanky squad, and uh, unfortunately the units I currently have over here are not mages. Ideally what would happen here, though, is we kill the healer, because if the healer's dead, God, we're so much better off. We can do this. Come on, squad. 
your stupid guards. We do like no damage. That is a tanky bastard. Oh, you dodged! 85% chance to hit. What a bastard. You stupid little die. That's right. That's what I thought. Okay, you're gonna be quite scary once you, uh, you know, actually get the ability to hit me here. Yeah, okay, and that's... That's where things went a little bit south. God, that guard. Yeah. Okay, we pretty much know how things are going from that spot. But... Yeah, that went pretty well. We lost Joseph, but now Elaine can run in and just kind of finish things. Should be able to. To me. But yeah, this is the struggle of doing this without... That is not what I wanted. There we go. Okay, another one of them down. It's just this... this annoying bastard. Uh... Hmm. Yeah. How much are you doing? 29. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of smashing my face into a brick wall right here. Let's see, do I... Ooh, that's a call. That's a call. Yeah, let's make a hit squad. Why don't we? So, let's take you out and you out. Let's put... Uh, where are you at? There you are. Travis in front here. And then I want... Let's see. Where are you at? I want Osh. Where's Yana? Should be, yep, yeah, right there. And then... Uh, get in there, Nina. I don't even think I really need to pay attention to what their items are, but let's see. Let's give you, you already have 82 evasion. Hmm. Don't know if I want that. Let's give you the power belt just in case you die. So there you go. All right, and what I want to do is deploy you. Let's take and out. teleport right there. Hello. Hand delivered. It's the whole reason I was like, oh, I need to get a mage down here, but it's kind of a pain in the ass to get a mage down here. Was uh, stop, stop. Sometimes it's hard to select the unit I want, but we can scroll. Yeah, we can select units this way. I need to do that when they're on top of each yeah. other. Alright, bye-bye! <laughs> nice knowing you, dumbass. That big shield's not gonna do anything to this. I'm here to help. There we are. And, oh yeah, and you even have magic attack. I forgot about that. Holy shit! Darkness. Approach this. I forgot I had you set up with that, too. That really is the magic hit squad. My magic is yours. Boom. Nope. Fireball. There we go. That's what I should have just done as soon as I got them over there. Good. You impressed? Have I always held such potential? To protect those who can't protect themselves. There we are. The Bulwark Tower Shield. Guard efficiency plus 50%. Yeah, that is pretty good. That is pretty good. Alright. Yeah, I would say that went pretty damn well. Took a while, but uh... I would say it went very well. I mean, look at how many enemies we killed, my god. 174,000 score. Yeah, look at all that honor. It is done. So it is. A 
at long last. Geeth is consigned to the hell of history where he belongs. None will remember his name. And even better, he'll like always go on remembered as like a, a traitor. Because that was the rumor that was being spread. And everyone we lost can finally rest easy. At least among like, you know, the other people in this general area. I'm sure that rumor spread. So rest in shit, you asshole. Justice was delivered this day. You can take things from here, Joseph. Princess. All right. Listen up. I've decided to leave the liberation. <laughs> Wait, what? Why? That, and I hereby dissolve the Knights of the Rose. You're free to live however you see fit. What? But why? We did it, my lady. Geeth's gone. That's exactly it. I spoke to him before he met his end, and the man didn't even remember who we were. I mean, he could have been lying just to piss you off, maybe, but I doubt he would do that. The corpses of those he murdered were nothing to him. Rid from his mind, you're the warmth had even left their bodies. All the while, I've been tortured by delusions of revenge. A damned slave to the past he had long since forgotten. Not only that, but I closed my ears to Joseph's plans, and in acting as I saw fit, put all of you in great danger. And now, I must answer for my wrongs. Please, my lady, don't belittle yourself. Virtue and justice play at the heart of your every action, as is proper for the paragon of Cornian royalty. <laughs> I'd think you were describing Elaine, not me. Apologies if this is out of line, your ladyship. But I have stood by your side for a number of years now, ever since you first stepped foot into Drakenhold. In that time, you have done what seemed impossible. Restored pride to this land, and encouraged its people to reclaim their home. I doubt you fully understand just how monumental an accomplishment that is. In you, Prince Gilbert saw the progeny of a ruined land, holding her head ever high despite the many sorrows she'd confronted. That noble spirit stirred the dormant fire in his breast, emboldened him to take up his sword once more. Where has that spirit gone, I ask? I've always counted your pride as a member of the royal line to be among your greatest strengths. Yet were Prince Gilbert to see you now, he would surely view it as nothing but a weakness. I dare you to say that again. Princess, the people of Cornea aren't the only ones who look to you for hope. L Leia is bold. Just talking, just talking some... So, you know, you know, like really, really being honest with you, you know, and clearly you're quite pissed off about that, but that's cool, Leia. You're cool. I know you want to bury your sword, but I ask that you don't bury the dreams of Drakenhold along with it. <sighs> Come on, Prince, say something. I must add my own plea to the roar, Virginia. In truth, there's still a great deal I've yet to learn. So many lessons left untaught the day I lost my mother. But that's precisely why I value having you beside me. To teach me the ways of Cornian royalty like no other can. I... I suppose I could stay on at least a little longer, seeing how desperately you need me. Yeah, you just gotta stroke the ego a little bit. Enough with your staring, all of you. Bashfulness doesn't suit me in the slightest. <laughs> <laughs> well, there we go. That was a pretty, uh, that was a pretty big side quest. For, like, a, you know, from a plot point. Old wound disturbing your sleep? Ah, princess. I was merely reflecting on that fateful day. A wound of a different kind, then. Queen Elenia surrendered herself to that monstrous blade, that the prince and I might escape it. Yet I can't help but wonder, 
Had I only faced Galerius in her stead, might my demise have spared her such a cruel fate? Perhaps she would be the one standing beneath this moonlit sky instead of me. She deserved to live, not I. It seems I too am slave to a past I cannot outrun. Both our hearts were scarred deep by what happened ten years ago. But that pain isn't ours alone. So many suffered that day. And so many suffer still. But there's still hope for peace. A lasting peace that can soothe the agony our people suffer. Elaine is that hope. The boy you saved, and the man you raised him to be. Take pride in that, Joseph. You grow more and more like Elenia with every setting sun, flying true as an arrow, urged forth by the strongest conviction. <laughs> I'm not sure I'd go that far. Joseph, I can't be the mother Elaine has lacked all these years. But I can whip him into shape every now and again. <laughs> Let's hold that whip together, shall we? All right. I do like that Joseph got a little bit more from this uh, this side quest. That was neat, but... All right. I think we're going to go ahead and end things off there and call that an episode. So, hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more. <laughs>